Batman's log. 1283. Record. I've been punching and kicking this St. Nicholas guy for hours now. He won't budge. How does he fucking do it? 24 hours. 24 hours. Millions of children. Coal in stockings. Eating milk and cookies. How the fuck does he do it? He goes by many names. Santa Claus. Saint Nick. Chris Kringle. He's shown up in many, many malls across the world. Children take pictures with him. They cry because he's so evil. I'm almost done with him. I've taken the gloves off because my hands are just so massive and meaty and powerful. They needed some air. Ah, this Santa Claus guy is gonna... He's gonna really take everything I got. I have a plan, though. We're gonna find out who he's working with. It's gotta be someone like the Joker, Scarecrow, Wait, Calendar Man. Yes, Julian Day, the Calendar Man. He's working with Kris Kringle. Ah, we got a whole new line of questioning for this fuck. I'm gonna shove this battering so far up his ass, he'll be able to use it at a tongue that tastes those stale cookies and expired milk. Happy holidays! <laughs> I'm, I'm stuck. <laughs> I'm actually stuck. What's going on everybody? My name is Eric. Welcome to the Nomad channel. And most importantly, Merry Christmas. Welcome to the 12th day of my 12 days of Christmas special. Once again, I am here with the digital Christmas card. Huge shout out to the Yemster there for what, uh, yet again, an amazingly uh, hilarious, entertaining video to start this off with. I Listen, every single year, I think I look forward to Yemi's video more than I do actually making this video. <laughs> like, that's the entire reason that I do the 12 Days of Christmas, is to finally get to Yemi's next creation. <laughs> Every single one is good. It's so good. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for another successful year of doing this. Uh, thank you guys for another successful year of Twitch and content and just being in my life, honestly, which I know sounds super dramatic and sim uh, sentimental, but it really, I really mean it this year. Um, those of you guys that have been around for a while know this, the back end of this year has not been friendly to me. Um, I had a lot of job stress from July until uh, mid-September, which got worse when I got laid off from my job. I've been unemployed the entire back fourth of this year, which has been extremely stressful on my wallet, uh, extremely stressful on my friends, uh, my roommates that have had to deal with me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but on the flip side, it has allowed me to be a little bit more with you guys. And also, as you guys have noticed, I've managed to revive this channel a little bit and get more content going over the last month or so. Uh, that's going to continue into the next year. And hopefully uh, we have a lot of memories to make going forward. I do have a lot of plans for next year. I want to do more Fireside Tales. That went over really well. You guys always love it. And I really want to do more collaborations, man. And I know I said that last year, but obviously uh, so much has happened this past year. Not just with me, but with a lot of the people that I'm that I friends with. Uh, we had Sheep that was going through her final uh, year of school. She just graduated once again. Huge congratulations, Sheep. She wasn't able to get a video in in time because she's been so busy at the end of the year here with her graduation. But Sheep, if you're watching, uh, huge congratulations to you. And I can't wait to see what you do in the future. Um, I know I've got a lot of friends um, that have um, a lot of, uh, 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 you know, a lot of stress and a lot of, uh, uh, I don't, I don't want to say trauma, but a lot of, a lot of uh, very uh, tough things happening this year. Uh, 
uh, Lepley's moving, um, which has been a super stressful thing for her. Um, obviously, hopefully that stress alleviates once she's finally able to get into her new place. Um, but we've met a lot of new people this year, too, that have been uh, welcoming parts of our lives. And speaking of Lepley, uh, she's introduced me to uh, Robitussin, who you guys might have seen. And uh, if you guys watch my ARC streams, uh, that's what I was playing with there. He's also been in chat a lot. Um, and uh, great guy. Love him. Uh, he's, he's a great influence uh, on us, a great person to be around, uh, and he's also been great for Lepley, so that's always been a huge plus for me, uh, since Lepley is like my mother. <laughs> um, but I know Kane's been going through it, Curse has been going through it, everyone's been going through it this year, man, and it's been, you know, it's been a very up and down year. I turned 30 this year, which has been an interesting uh, thing to have to deal with, um, and it's been a lot of things on my mind turning 30, you know, I'm not exactly where I thought I would be when I was 30, uh, when I, you know, turning 30, and, um, not to say that it's a bad thing, because my outlook on life has changed, uh, for both the better and the worse, um, but it's definitely made me want to chase my dreams a little bit more, um, we've lost people this year, um, I've had loss in my life that I haven't really talked about, um, and it's also kind of kicked me in a high gear going, okay, I need to, I need to take care of things, you know, I, I need to, if I want these things to, to be a reality, then we need to shoot for them. Um, Lepley's doing it with her move, uh, something that's been needed to be done. Uh, Kane's been making moves. Uh, Curse has made moves. Um, Dan has made moves. He, uh, I can't wait for you guys to see his video in a little bit, um, that he sent me, uh, cause that's phenomenal. And I can, I'm so glad Dan's back. I, uh, Echo Drone, uh, is, is, is his username. I'm so glad that he's back. I've missed him to death. And, and he obviously took time for himself. Again, a lot of healing that's been needed to be done this year, but I'm so glad he's back. Um, and, and I'm really excited for this. Um, I'm definitely wanting to do more stuff with my cousin. Uh, if you guys watch the Lethal Company stream, um, I'm going to be making videos out of that as well. Uh, I'm so glad I was able to do that with him. I've had so many people, Kokor, uh, Chaotic Wolf that has been uh, in the Final Fantasy 14 streams all year. And, and, and the list goes on. I, I could thank every single person individually and we'd be here for 20 minutes. But really, everyone knows uh, who's, who's had any impact on my life. And um, I really hope the best for you guys next year. Um, I've had a lot of friends that have left the streaming game, and I hope the future for you guys is, is really positive as well. Um, but that is enough out of my mouth. It is almost 1 a.m. I have to get to bed because I have a very busy day tomorrow. Uh, this It's Thursday night into Friday morning when I'm recording this, and I've got a very busy day tomorrow uh, preparing for the final uh, Christmas tree. <laughs> which will be the painting stream, which has already happened by the time you see this. <laughs> anyway, guys, enough out of me. You guys have a fantastic Christmas. You guys have a fantastic end of 2023, a fantastic 2024. And without further ado, here are my friends. Hello, everyone. Merry Christmas and a happy holidays from all of us here at the Fireside. Thank you all for supporting us, myself, Lethley, and, of course, Eric. It's been a very weird year for us all. But uh, it's been a fun one in terms of content. Look forward to doing more of it next year. I hope you're there with us too. Hey everybody! I don't have a whole lot of holiday spirit this year because I'm moving. <laughs> and it's been very crazy. But I wanted to record uh, a little Christmas greeting. So I hope you and yours have a wonderful holiday. And whether that's by yourself or with family or with friends. I hope it's magical and wonderful and I hope you have a great rest of 2023 and a wonderful 2024. I love you all. Bye. Happy Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Hey there. You might not recognize me. And even if you do, it's probably from some time ago. Here I am. See, the truth of the matter is, some time ago, I was kidnapped by a bunch of rabid marmosets. Luckily, the fire type team came along to uh, bail me out, but they're still after my blood, so I have to wait until school ends. So I'm really looking forward to getting back into the community and seeing what we can come up with. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So to everyone out there, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, I hope you enjoy your Christmas, your Hanukkah, whatever it is you celebrate. Just as long as you get to share it with loved ones, because that's what's important. 
And uh, let's see what we can do in 2024. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be bigger than Jesus. Also, it's summer in Australia right now and I'm wearing a suede jacket, so bye.